Okay, I'm going to give you five steps to follow to lose weight faster eating anything you like. So yes, that means you can eat all the salty, sugary, and fatty foods you like and still lose weight just as fast as someone who's eating healthy. So if you're a beginner or have a hard time sticking to a weight loss diet, then this is going to be the perfect plan for you to start off with. Okay, here's the five steps. Step one, you're going to eat 1,200 to 2,000 calories per day. Step two, you're going to eat anything you want, and here's why. For example, if you need to eat 2,000 calories per day to maintain your current weight, and you end up eating 2,000 calories per day, then you're going to maintain your weight. But if you eat over 2,000 calories per day, even if you eat the healthiest foods in the world, you're going to gain weight and vice versa. If you eat under 2,000 calories per day, and let's say you eat 1,500 calories worth of fast food hamburgers every day, then you're going to lose weight no matter what simply because you're not eating enough to maintain your current weight. So it doesn't matter what you eat when it comes to losing weight. And as, and as you can see, losing weight, gaining weight, and maintaining your weight all depends on how much you eat or how many total calories you eat per day. And since the average person needs anywhere between 2,000 to 3,000 calories per day to maintain their weight, you're going to lose weight fast once you start eating 1,200 to 2,000 calories per day no matter what you eat. Okay, step three, eat whenever you want. Okay, we already covered this in steps one and two. Losing weight is based on how much you eat and not what you eat. So weight loss is definitely not based on when you eat. So forget about all the crazy myths about not eating after 6 p.m. and you don't have to eat five meals per day. You can eat one to three bigger meals per day. It does not matter when or what you eat as long as you eat 1,200 to 2,000 calories per day. Step four, drink at least one liter of water every day. You need to do this so you won't gain any water weight by retaining water or getting bloated, making you gain false fat. And if most of your 1,200 to 2,000 calorie diet is going to be made up of salty, sugary, and fatty foods, then you're going to have to drink more than one liter of water per day to help you flush out any excess water weight you gain from having too much sodium or salt in your diet. Step five, keep a food journal. You can use the free food journal at knowledge.com slash FG, make your own food journal, or just do a search on the internet for a food or calorie journal that you can use. But you need to keep a food journal so you can make changes in your diet to help you lose weight faster. So for example, let's say you're not happy with how fast you are currently losing weight. So you look at your food journal and you see that you're eating 1,700 calories per day. So from now on, you may start eating 1,500 calories a day to speed up your weight loss. And if you never kept a food journal, you would have no idea where to start making changes. Now, I know I said it does not matter what you eat, but you also need to track the foods you eat. Because, for example, let's say you're hungry all the time, craving for more food. Well, if you look at your food journal and most of your 1,200 to 2,000 calorie diet is salty, sugary, and fatty foods, then you'll know that you need to add more fiber, complex carbs, fruits, and veggies in your diet to help you fight the hunger, or you could simply eat closer to 2,000 calories to fight hunger. But before you get excited about eating all these salty, sugary, and fatty foods you like to lose weight, here's four reasons why you probably would not want most of your 1,200 to 2,000 calorie diet to be made up of salty, sugary, and fatty foods. Reason number one, you'll probably gain weight eating a lot of unhealthy foods. Those good tasting, salty, sugary, and fatty foods only make you want to eat more. They cause constant cravings, and chances are you may give in to those cravings. Not all the time, but it'll certainly cause you to have some days where you eat more than 2,000 calories, and this will make you either gain weight or not lose much weight at all. Reason number two, You'll lose weight faster avoiding salty, sugary, and fatty foods as much as possible. Healthy foods like fruits and vegetables, complex carbs like oatmeal, lean proteins like organic chicken, and other unprocessed foods fill you up quicker and keeps you satisfied much longer 
than these salty, sugary, and fatty foods. And when most of your 1,200 to 2,000 calorie diet is made up of healthier, unprocessed foods, it's going to be harder for you to eat all of your 1,200 to 2,000 calories per day because you're going to be fuller and satisfied much longer from eating them. And you may have some days where you eat less than 1,200 calories and still be satisfied. And as you know, the less you eat, even if it's less than 1,200 calories, while still being satisfied with very little or no cravings, equals the faster you will lose weight and keep it off for good. Reason number three, you get to eat more. Salty, sugary, and fatty foods have a very high calorie density. And what that means is you have to eat a lot of healthy, unprocessed foods to equal the same amount of calories and a much smaller amount of salty, sugary, and fatty foods. Look at this picture here if you don't understand. You need to eat four apples to get the same amount of calories in one Snickers bar. And don't drink away all your calories. You want to avoid sugary drinks like sodas. And yes, you should even avoid diet sodas because they're basically full of empty calories that make you crave for more soda or a lot more bad foods, which will make you eat too much and gain weight. So instead of wasting away parts of your diet on sugary drinks, drink all the water you want, which has zero calories and helps you burn fat faster. Reason number four, you'll look better naked and live longer eating more healthier unprocessed foods. Look, this has nothing to do with you losing weight, but when you eat a diet that, that is mostly high in salty, sugary, and fatty foods, then you're only increasing your chances of getting ugly teeth, bad skin, acne, wrinkles, which will basically just make you look old and not attractive. And common sense should tell you that eating a lot of sugary, salty, and fatty foods will put you in a hospital much quicker than you eating healthier, unprocessed foods. Now, although you can eat whatever you want, whenever you want, and still lose weight on this 1,200 to 2,000 calorie diet, because of the four reasons I just went through, it's best that you gradually work your way up to a point where 80% or 960 to 1,600 of your 1,200 to 2,000 calories comes from healthy foods. And the other 20% or 240 to 400 calories comes from salty, sugary, and fatty foods. So number one, you'll lose weight as fast as possible. And number two, you won't have to go cold turkey and you can still enjoy all these salty, sugary, and fatty foods you like. And finally, number three, you'll be satisfied much longer on lesser calories with very little or no cravings at all. So let's recap the five steps you need to follow to lose weight faster eating whatever you like. Step one, you eat 1,200 to 2,000 calories per day. Step two, you eat anything you like. Step three, you eat whenever you like. Step four, drink at least one liter of water per day. And step five, keep a food journal. If you have any questions or need more help, then go to nowloss.com slash diet. And although you'll lose weight fast just by following those five steps, you'll lose weight almost twice as fast if you work out. So also go to knowledge.com slash I to see how you can lose up to four pounds per week doing interval workouts.